I don't know about you hunters, but I'm ready to find some good clearance deals. Inside Walmart hunters where we are on the hunt today to find some good clearance deals. We're crossing our fingers, we come across quite a few. So oh, let's over right. here in the clearance aisle, we got double clearance aisle. Let's get in here and see what we can find today. Under hood, light, 25, seems full price. How about this Cuisinart Art pizza oven? Tag says seven, it's pretty fresh. Mailbox, couple lights, filters. Man, this is a hodgepodge today. What's this, Heart Household Toolkit. 39 down from 56, pretty fresh. They have a lot of sunshades for your cars. We're gonna check this aisle behind us. We're gonna finish here first. This is a nice one, Pure. 21 down from 42. Looks like we got an Infantino, what is this? Four in one jumbo gym and ball pit. It says 30 down from 70, tags fresh. Hey, eight bucks down from 37. I actually wanted to grab this. See if we can find one that's in nicer condition. Here we go. We're gonna get that for personal use. 50 for the Polk subwoofer down from 99. It's interesting though, the kind of clearance that they have today. Seven for the pizza maker, we've already seen that. Mingling board set five. These have been out here for a while and as you can see, they're marked down to three bucks from 21. What is it again? Yeah, a little activity mat. There's a VTEC audio monitor. 25 down from 55. Car covers, 25 down from 46. Got some kickers, 30 down from 64. That's a pretty good deal. 40 down from 80 for the double. 50 down from 120 for the adjustable tow bar. Very good. That's a very good deal right there. We'll have to keep eyes on that one. There's a subwoofer down here, 74 down from 98. They kind of cleaned out the audio section it's looking like. What we got down here, 30, but do we have the was price, 69? Not bad. 12 down from 22 for the alignment system. These things are great when you have a really small trailer and you can't see what's going on. Great value, lead remover pitch filter. Nine down from 18, this might be pretty good. This is a nice deal. Seven down from 30 for the Fisher Price Smooth Move Slaw. And it's a little beat up down there on the bottom. Unfortunately, that would have been a good buy. Five down from 11. Got the bidet down to 10 bucks. Not much left on the rest of that clearance aisle. Uh, looks like we still have a lot of the trowels, the cultivators, the hose attachments. There was one thing I wanted to check while I was in here is the kids longhand tool set. If this thing's five bucks, we'll probably end up grabbing this and we should probably check on this greenhouse. It does appear to be in good condition. What do we got on the kids tool set? I think we'll get that for six bucks. Let's check on this greenhouse, the four tier greenhouse. Four tier greenhouse is 31. I'd say that's probably half of what it originally was. Bunch of hoses, the tags are all pretty fresh. This is the audio monitor from the other aisle. 10 down from 21 for the landscape fabric. And we have a pool right here. We got 20 on the pool, if so, we'll take it. No, definitely not 45. Let's check these because I saw these at another store for five, 27.92. Full price still. What do we got back here? Air conditioner, 40, 40 bucks down from 192. The box is all messed up, but this one's pretty good. That one's really good actually. How much for the bug salt machine? Bug salt machine is $20, full price. Curious about the turf builder. Not working with scan and go. Then we got a grill and a lawnmower sitting on a pallet behind these aisles right here. What's going on with these? We're gonna need to scan it, see what we got on the Cuisinart. What is it? Five burner gas grill, 249. And then we need a barcode for this lawnmower right here. We got high price 197. This store has far too much lawn and garden stuff and I can see why because they're just holding on. This stuff should have been long gone. Let's head out into the lawn and garden section see if we can check on some other things. All right, so they've got half Christmas, half lawn and garden out here. They must still be getting their shipments in. I wanna see if they have the Big Daddy. I'm not seeing it. The Lockhart is what I want. I don't think it was showing up at this store. I have something down there at the end. Let's check this out. But for the Lockhart, I'll go ahead and put image skew and UPC right up here so you guys can take a look and see if it's in your area. Now remember, you're not going off of quantity. You're going off of price for Brixie. Then you're gonna have to put your boots in the ground and actually see if it is indeed 
at that store for that price. Let's scan this egg chair, see what we got on the egg chair. Full price, I do not like that one bit. I know these Pit Boss tabletops were on clearance at one point in time, 137. There's a Blackstone back there. How about this two burner gas top? Oh, 69, full price. Let's head out of here and into the toy section, see what we can find. Now we're gonna walk through here check top stock check the regular aisles see if we can see any clearance tags see if we can find anything that kind of jumped out at us from the path i'm only seeing a couple clearance tags and these are for the lols see what we got 17 these are all in the wrong spots too if you're reading the tags so that says 24 this tag says travel sunset that says travel city baby so you may have to like look in through there and see which ones are which this store used to have their clearance all on this back aisle right through here. We're gonna try to see if we can find some deals in through here. Let's check this Magic Mixies. I've seen this on clearance at other stores, 64. Uh, now these La La Loopsies uh, should be, I think it's the girl with the yellow hair. As low as five now. This one is six bucks, so we'll probably grab her for six. Let's check her friend with the purple hair. There's another yellow hair. Do we have six on her? We have six on her as well. We'll probably grab her too. Let's check this My Life up here. Let's see what we got on this one. 32, full price. Let's check this Moving and Grooving. Ride on. 39.84, so full price. Now, speaking of ride ons, I want you guys to be scanning all of the ride on equipment, all the scooters, and all of the hoverboards for sure. I don't want you to miss out on a deal that you could easily grab. Let's check this razor down here, E100. Now sometimes they'll ask you for a serial number after you scan the barcode. It's gonna be right up here or maybe in a different location. I like it when they keep it away from each other because the Walmart app sucks when scanning different barcodes. You don't even need it for this one, 148. How much for this, uh, what is this? Oh, a Segway scooter. Segway scooter is 148. A bunch of clearance tags in through here. The Princess scooter is 19 down from 29. This one is the Hello scooter. This one is Avenger scooter. They're all here, so make sure you scan them. Unicorn bouncer and bull bouncer. Here is a unicorn bouncer right here. Let's check on the Princess scooter. Is it still 19? Yep, still 19. We can check on the Avenger scooter. Avenger scooter is also still 19. As you can see, there is a lot of hoverboards to scan. And some of them, if they give you this barcode, you're good. But if they give you the other barcode, you're not good. See, this one's 101 down from 138. We got tags on them, but we've seen them way, way lower. That's gonna be the same one as this. Let's check this one right here. And I want you to keep in mind that there may be some hiding in the back too, because people are hiding them waiting for the price to go down. This one won't work with scan and go. Let's check the uh, My First Hoverboard. See this barcode right here is the one I was telling you about. It doesn't always work for some reason with the Walmart app. Let's see if it will today. See, this item isn't available for purchase with scan and go. Let's try something else. We're gonna try to check a price. See if the check a price will work. So 98, but this is not always accurate. That's why we use scan and go, so. Take it with a grain of salt. Let's check those Jetsons up top. Jetson Plasma X. It says 148 for the checker price. Now let's go back to Scan and Go and see if we got it for the same. Scan serial number. And the serial number is 148. I'd also be curious about this Razer MX125. These Voyagers, I know I've seen people grab these. Looks like the blue one's 99, down from 144. Here's a blue one, but once again, it's got that crappy barcode that we don't like. Now let's check this MX125 scooter. I scanned it because I don't want the thing to fall on her head. Eight to so 75 bucks. Interesting, what is the was price on that? You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna ask Google. Razer MX125 dirt bike. What do we got? Oh, 198? If that's true, we got ourselves a winner winner chicken dinner right there. Let's double check. Razer MX125, eBay's got it, Walmart's got it for 198. One, 198 on walmart.com. It's a little bit different color, but hey, they got two of them, we're gonna grab those. Hot dog. Oh, yes, 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 Now let's check this uh, Rave Ultra Terrain. Hopefully it doesn't have that bad barcode. Uh, no, right up here, good, good, good. Let's scan this one. How much is this one? Probably gonna want a serial number. Of course it's not available. 
Let's try the check of price. 198. Sold online for Walmart for 178. You see that guys? So if you do find something in the store that is cheaper on Walmart, make sure it's sold and shipped by walmart.com and they should price match it 100%. What else do we got in here? Let's check for any can jams. Anything that we've gotten in the past, battle bags, any of those. Here's some for 20, down from 40. Tag is pretty old. How much is the score and sound? Football target, let's get back into scan and go so we can get the accurate price in the store, 20 bucks. Do they have any of the big trampolines? These little trampolines. The big trampolines we were seeing, people get as low as 50 bucks. What are these big coolers doing up here? 88 bucks, they're staying up there now. Let's get into this aisle. Oh, look, there's another dirt bike. Oh, it's the one that's above it. This is the daddy. This is the baby one. Let's scan this one though, because you never know. We might get lucky and be able to take this home too. This one is 328. Rival Go Tracks, 298. Battery powered Segway one, 398. All right, but look, look what we got in here. We got a buttload of stuff just kind of thrown in here. So we're gonna kind of scan away and see what we can find. Swing set down here on the bottom. Swing set is 349. We were seeing these long, long ago, these unicorns with a stick of gum on the side, 25 bucks. Now we are going to make our way to our first item on our list. I'll go ahead and put image skew and UPC right up here for you so you guys can take a look and see if it's in your area. Now we need to head over to the arts and crafts section. It's crafts and sewing, whatever you want to call it. We're gonna check over there first, but I have a feeling it is in the back room. Now make sure with bean bags you guys are looking for that camo bean bag. The Big Joe, the camo colored one, is the one you want, bringing up nine bucks. All right, here we are over in the Cricut aisle. This is an old deal we found before. If you guys remember, we were grabbing the Cricut Maker for 80, what was it, 85? In this store, it should be 115, which is not bad, and they should have quite a few of them. We're gonna get that barcode scan just to verify, but I wanna go ahead and show you on the Walmart app what we're looking for once again, the Cricut Maker Machine Champagne Edition. We're crossing our fingers. Let's go get that barcode scan. Now, before I go ahead and get that barcode scan, I forgot to take you over into tools and hardware because some of the shelving units are starting to clearance out. There's one in particular we're looking for. It's an enclosed one that goes in the garage not seeing this either and it would normally would be in this area i'll go ahead and put image skew in upc right up here so you guys can take a look and see if it's an area it is as low as 30 dollars in this store um, but i'm just not seeing it only the metal ones this one is plastic so now we can scan both of those at the same time kind of get an idea of what's going on all right so the counts on the cricket machine are six but it's on the sales floor we're having someone go in the back room and then the counts on the garage cabinet unfortunately are a big fat zero uh we'll just have to keep looking around for it back over here in the cricket aisle just to do one more double check i know these are not the boxes but i know i have to get my eyes on it they went in the back room but unfortunately they weren't able to locate it apparently the back room is flooded with items from the truck this store is notorious for having the counts being off, but I don't see how you can have six being off. I surely wish we would have found it. We're gonna cross our fingers. We're gonna check back in on this store at a later time. Maybe it'll pop back up. But I would say overall, finding these dirt bikes saved our butt at this store. I think that's gonna do it for this episode, guys. If you enjoyed it, please on your way out, go ahead and smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. Make sure you hit the bell notification to stay up to date on all the latest and greatest episodes, guys. And remember, always keep up the hunt.